All right, YouTube, what's happening? Um, this knife is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, it came in the battle box this month, and it's one I've been looking at prior to this. Um, I think it was like right after I finished filming my Axis, you know, crossbar lock video I just did. Looked at a bunch of premium and, and budget offerings, and someone in the comments said, check out the um, Real Steel Sakura, Sakura, whatever you say it, and I was like, that's not a bad idea, but I already filmed the video and I already spent money on these knives and yeah. So this one came in Battle Box, which was good timing. So this is their exclusive version. Um, it's got like a gray G10 with blue um, accents everywhere. The pod clip, the integral steel um, liner, I guess we'll call it. And then it has blue thumb studs, but the thumb studs also glow in the dark, which is actually pretty cool. They're not tritium, so I don't know what they are, but they work pretty well. They glow pretty well. So, um, and I would have totally included this one in my video. Uh, there's just so many options out there. It was impossible to possibly get every single one because I'd be spending stupid amounts of money. So, um, but I was glad that BattleBox sent this out because um, it's it's a pretty unique uh, variant of this. I know they have a tactical version also, they call it, where they have um, like Cody Green, Coyote, Black, G10, it's like a coated blade. It's a Tanto, Japanese Tanto style blade versus a drop point on this guy. Um, plus they have all kinds of different variations with Micarta, other G10s. So it's a, you know, a, definitely a, a cool knife for under hundred bucks. I think it's 70 bucks, 75 bucks, depending on the model you go with. Uh, but I will tell you right now that the action on this guy is by far the best. That is zero blade play locked down pivot guys like there is no side to side up down play and that action is insane like so good like way better than any of the other budget ones i checked out i could get my kershaw to do that uh, maybe the voss deed but they usually had uh blade play this is super solid lock up and it has a good detent too so not only does it have the best action, but I would say it has the best detail. Let's see, can we shake it out? No, yep, finally, but that took a lot of effort to get that out. So not only does this have the best action of the budget folders, but it has the best detent. And what am I hitting here that my, I'm stepping on something, making my tripod move a little bit. Um, so if you're in the market and you want a good crossbar st style lock, they call this the slide lock, but everyone has their own naming convention for it. Um, but if you want a good crossbar lock on a budget, I would recommend the Real Steel Sakura over pretty much anything else under hundred bucks. It's that good. Um, it's the action, the detent, the different variations you can get. Um, I'll put a link in the description to a bunch of them. This one, I don't know, BattleBox might sell this on their website. And I do have a discount code you could use. I'm not sure what they sell it for, but I'll put it in the link in the description below. But I know there's a bunch of these available on Amazon, which I'll also link. So yeah, guys, I think you should check it out if you're interested in a budget crossbar lock. I think the Real Steel Soccer is actually probably the best of the bunch. Thanks for watching this short little video, and we'll see you next time.